just going to go over the equipment that we're going to use in class today. So if you're looking around, any modifications that you're looking for as well, we're going to go ahead. The one thing I don't have, I don't have water. That's going to be interesting. We're fine. We're fine. I'll live. Okay. So we got a set of hand weights. If you are not, you, this is your modification. So a lot of the times you can use these hand weights when we're doing arm workout if you don't have a band that you like. But if you have a light resistance band or a medium, you do you. I need you to take your challenge. A little bit heavier with the medium, a little bit lighter. Our arm work's gonna be with that here today. So for the obliques though, and legs, we're gonna use this medium resistance band. And we're also gonna use a heavy resistance band. So you can either have the band version. So you either want like a really thick, pretty sturdy band version, or you're gonna have the fabric version. That's just what I have right here. So um, it just slides on and off easy. No biggie if you don't. Uh, those discs, those slides, right there for you. So these, you can also use a washcloth, if not. So if we're using it for some sort of pushing movement, they're gonna slide across the floor. Guess what, so do these. Um, I was telling the other class, I get some questions. Sometimes people are like, are, is there a specific way you're supposed to use them? I don't wanna kinda of mess up my floor, so I like using the softer part onto the floor. Don't even know if that's 100% right. I've had a lot of people say that you should use the other side, but for me, I just feel like it gets scratchy on my floors and I have a dog, I already have enough scratches. Okay, so that's what's going on right here. Take a deep breath in. Whew. Okay guys, here we go. My name's Megan, I am a Legree and row former instructor out here in Orange County. I teach at Trim Fitness Studio, I teach at Hard Fit. Love them, miss them like crazy, miss so many of you guys, um, but somehow, we all have found a way to keep moving and I'm so honored and so excited that I get to do that with you guys every day. Um, so as we move those bodies, I just wanna start just with that mindful of just gratitude. Just take that breath in, let the rest of the day go. I know sometimes it's so much about that mental health, as much as it is that physical health that we get out of this benefit here. So just check in for you. Check in for you and know that you have already done your part in just being here. Everything you get to give into your body here is a gift. Everything we get to do together is a gift. And we're just going to take it and enjoy it together. So with all that said, we're going to get warm up with that core. We're going to start nice and simple here. We're going with the wheelbarrow. You ready? Let's go, 530. Here we go. So I'm going to grab those discs. Place them into my hands right here. Take yourself out into a modified push-up position. So lock the top of the shins down. Now hinging out, reach out, hold. Slowly drag it right back in. That timer is on, let's go. Dig through the heel, the hands pull. Squeeze, stop the hands before they come under the shoulders. All right, first movements here, pop. This is where you just check in, set the tone. Inhale out, exhale, pull, drag, squeeze, Stop before the hands come underneath the shoulders. All right, where we're gonna find is those center abdominals for me right here. I want you to pinch that belly button. Bring it back, hug it to the spine. It's gonna stay there for the remainder of class. You're gonna take that right here. Use that core control and add that breath in. Inhale all the way out, hold, pause. Exhale slowly, pull it right back in. Woo, feel that work start to come in. Okay, lock in right here. I like to ask my classes, pick a word, pick a phrase. I want you to pick something this evening to be your mantra. Something that is bigger than the shake, something that is bigger than the camp, or anything that could be telling you to give up. That's where I need your mindset right here. Check it in, we have our first hold. Halfway hold in four. Let that core shake, hold it halfway, three, two, Hold it here, let's go, little inches, in one, hold. Out one, pause, it's small. Take it in one, hold. Take it out one, pause. Right there, so good. Little pulse, little release. So don't let those hips be back over those knees. Keep yourself forward into this move here. Exhale, squeeze it in. Inhale, take it out. We go back 20 seconds, full range in three. Pull it in first, in two, one set there. 
switch it out for four. Yes, you can for three. Take it slow for two. Hold there. I want you to lift with your abs first. Squeeze your abs, pull in for four. Squeeze your abs, push into the shins for three. Two, hold one more just like that. Make it your best. Take it right here. Feel that heart rate start to pick up, that's yours. Work for it here. Good, you guys, breathe it out. We go super crunch. Bring your feet onto one disc in front of you in three, two, one. Sit where your tailbone was. Bring both your feet together on one disc or two. I like the one. Take those arms out, lay it back and down. Hover into that 45 degree angle. Dig through the heels. Slowly pull it in. Stop before the shoulders come in front of the hips. Inhale out. Slow. Pull. Exhale. Dig. So there's this little point of control where the hard part for me right here is when I'm trying to keep that constant push down through the heels. Feel the low abs start to fire up. It's all that control right here. Legree is all about slow, slow control movement. We remove all the momentum. So everything has to go through those stabilizer muscles right here. Good, breathe it in. Pull that core and get the shoulders. Pop your chest open. Think posture. Get the neck long, chin off the chest, reach it back. Two, three, hold it right there, scoop it up, come on. Take it in. Woo, stop before the top, take it right back out, breathe. Good, you guys, we got one inch pulses with that upper body. Hold it, that halfway point, get so honest with me. Here we go, hold it in three, two, one. Are you exactly where you need to be? Get there, get there right now, let's go. Little pulses, down an inch, hold. Up an inch, pause. Last eight right here, down an inch, hold. Up an inch, pause. Yes, you guys, so good. We flip it over. You give me a plank. You hold it. In three, two, one. Put your feet onto those discs because we're going to move it into that plank to pike pretty quick soon. You got an option to take both feet onto a single disc or you can use both discs. I like putting both feet together. Squeeze those inner thighs in. Push away with the hands. Scoop the abs up and in. Reach the crown of the head long. Pull that core in, yes, you guys. All right. Close those eyes for a second. You've given yourself these first three movements of class to work to get going. How do you feel? What do you need to check in right here? What do you need to leave at the door for these last 10? What needs to come out of your head and what needs to go into it so that we power through these next 35 together in three? Pull it up slow in two. One, let's go up for four. Up for three, plank to pipe, two. Stay high on those tippy toes, take it out for four. Take it out for three. Two, yes, Monday, come on, 5.30, come on. Pick it up, squeeze it up. Belly button is just fine, hips come tall, push away from those hands. You are not falling into your wrists. Your wrists are not getting heavy, those arms are getting strong. Push away through the palms. Push away, lift, pull all the way up, squeeze, slowly let it back and down. Good, you guys, so there isn't a recovery point here. That plank is the recovery. The lift is all control, and it's just as much control to let it back and down. Slow, slow, pull the low abs in. Last 12, let's go, take it up. Breathe it up. Pull, squeeze, slowly take it right back out. So good, you guys, you got this right here. Breathe with it, don't let it go. Final challenge, take it out to that plank. Now, if you need to give those wrists a break, you can drop to those forearms right here. Otherwise, you're up, hands and toes. 30 seconds, flying wheelbarrow, push it back. Hold, pull it over, pause, right here. This is it for your core, you do not come back to those center abdominals till the very end of class. It's two inch movements right here, you're sawing back and away from those hands. Pull it up and over. Woo, there we go. Good, you guys, we're gonna find that heavy resistance band. Strapping it around those legs. We're going left foot forward here Monday. Spider lunge in three, in two, in one. All right, bring that disc with you. You need one disc. Feet come into that heavy resistance band. Strap it in, drop it down into that squat. Drop the booty low. Come up onto that back foot. Now kick it back at a diagonal for me here. I want you to feel that press. Push back out and away. Outer glute, outer thigh, slowly. Take it in. Breathe, hold. 
drop it down an inch, push it out. There we go. Good, you guys, so it's that first leg exercise of class. Feel the power that you have right here. These first movements, you should be sitting at your lowest. This is where you set your expectation. This is where you lock into that form. Square the hips, square the core. So left foot is forward, right foot is in the band on the toe on the disc. Pushing it back, find the inner thigh of that right side. Slowly take it right back in. Breathe, stop at that halfway, take it right back out from there. Good, you guys, every time you reach it out, you stop before that leg locks out. Don't let that knee come over that toe. Push down through the knife edge of that foot. Hold it in. Sit low, push it back. Two, three, I'm gonna turn to that side for that side angle view. You stay low, take it low, push it back. Reach, hold, slowly take it in. See how this knee is gonna stay right in line with that hip? Push it back. Take it out, hold. Good, you guys, halfway hold in just another six. We're gonna hold it halfway in three, two, left foot forward, right foot back, drop it down one. Push it out one, hold. Drop it down two. Push it out two, hold. Now Monday, go for three. Take it back three. You start the week strong in for one, in for two, in for three, hold there. Push it out for one, out for two, out for three right there, little inches. Tiny little pushes, come on. Little inches here, don't let it go. Give it that fight, give it that press. Stay with it for eight. Good, you guys, for six. You go back to that full range. Make it happen in three, two, get low, get low. Pull it in, now that core. Pull up and away. Outer glute, outer thigh is on, pushing, go, go, go. Remember, you are sitting into that outer glute, sitting into that pocket, that back pocket on that left leg. Warm it up, hang on to it here. Good, you guys, we got just another six. You're gonna hold it back for me. Hold it back, breathe in three, two, hold it there. Deep breath in, sit lower. Deep breath in, exhale, push it back, reach those arms out. Just hold, just hold. Yes, you can, stay here. For six, we're going outer thigh squats. Step that foot up in three, in two, in one. Outer thigh squats, drop it down. Okay, equal going right and left. We switch right into that outer thigh, outer glute, outer thigh going. That left side should be getting that little extra push, but as you even out, you keep the chest up. Keep the knees pointed over the second, third toes. Lock it down, hold, breathe. Keep through those heels, yes you can. Good, you guys, keep that little push. Check in right here. 30 seconds. This is our transitional move, because that next move we're going into is an iso hold as well. So that, that spider lunge, we're holding down into the left leg the whole time, pushing out at that back diagonal. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna take it back into the booty. Here we go. Hold it down, hold low for me in three. Hold low, two, one, hold it right here. Stay right here, shoulders out of the ears, core and tight, go down one more. Take it up an inch, pause. We're gonna ditch this band. You got an elevator lunge on the left. Going left leg strong. Ditch the band, step it out. In three, in two, in one, kick it off right there. Okay, left foot forward, right foot back. That weight is off, now we drop it down low into the back of that glute, hold, squeeze. Slowly climb it up four. Climb it up three, two, stop there. Take it right back down. Breathe, chest up, core tight. I like to keep those hands up at heart center. If you keep those hands above that heart, it helps keep the heart rate up. Helps keep that calorie burn going high. Stay with it here, breathe it out. Slowly rise, go back to that four count right here. No matter what that leg is telling you, you go down low. You find that 90 push into it. I'm realizing my white is sinking into my bedspread right here. I'm trying to find that sweet spot. Take it down. Say it low. Hold it right there. Take it back up. Push it up. Breathe. Stop before the top. Take it right back down. Stack your left knee over. So in an elevator lunge, your front foot is on the platform. I want you to imagine this being on the platform. Your back foot's on the moving carriage. Stand through that stationary platform. Stand up into it, stop before the leg walks out. Squeeze the inner thighs in, let's go. You got 10 seconds left and we're gonna go into that first challenge, that first hold going all the way down. We go right into those carriage kicks. Take it down in six. 
Take it down, hold it, chest up, core tight. Three, two, bend that knee in, drag it in for four. Three, two, hold there, push it right back out. Two, three, hold right there, stay into it. Keep heavy on that front heel, come on. Stand through that front leg right here. Feel the low abs control to bring the knee underneath. Take it out. There you go, guys, here we go. For eight, back to full range, reach it out, reach it out in three, two, hold, climb it up for four. Climb it up for three, two, stop there, take it back down. Okay, here's where it gets nice and shaky. Push it up, breathe it out. Stop there, take it down, go low. Breathe with it here, guys, you guys, so strong. Come on, commit to it, hold to it. We got just six, hold it all the way down. Meet me there, 10 seconds, hold in three, two, hold it there. All right, guys, we're finishing off that left leg with that bungee kick. Get ready for it. That bungee's coming on. You're gonna go into a tabletop position. Strap the bungee around, or strap that band around both your feet. Kick it up in four. Reach a little longer for three, two, one. Let's go. Quick transition. Can you get there in five? You take that band. All right, guys. We're going medium resistance band today. Let's go. We ain't messing around Monday. Take it around. Put it around the feet. Come into that tabletop. Kick your left foot up. Push it up. Up two, down one. Oh my goodness. Okay, push it up. Hold, slowly take it down. Get that knee right beneath you. Is your left glute screaming at you? Because mine is yelling at me right now. It's okay, it's telling you just how dang strong it's getting. Come on, pick it up, pull it in, core tight. Good, you guys. Hold me accountable, I'll hold you accountable. Let's go, we don't let it drop. Stay with it, breathe. Something happens when you make that decision right here. I want you to choose 20 seconds for you. 20 seconds where you are not gonna let it drop, you push a little higher. You hold a little stronger. Come on, it's eight. Look how fast that goes. You hold it all the way up. We're going hamstring curls to finish. Yes, you can, do not give up. If I told you you had 60 seconds left with your left leg, what would you do? Hamstring curls, you kick it out. We curl back in in three, two, one, kick it out, kick it out. Left foot is in that band, curling. Pull that left heel in. Left heel comes to that glute, hold. Take it out. Here we are. Last push. Get that knee as high as you possibly can. Keep that core tight. Shoulders stacked over those hands. Neck is reaching long. Imagine your tailbone and the crown of your head reaching opposite directions. Now punch that gut in. Pull it up, squeeze. Hold the inner thighs together. You're strong right here. Hold it straight in eight. Hold it straight, kick it all the way back. Three, two, hold it there. Little straight leg lifts, up an inch. Down an inch, yes you can, you go up an inch. Down an inch, don't let it go. We keep that band around our feet. Laying back onto this here, I'm just gonna roll onto my tailbone. We're going right into those banded bicycles in three, two, one. Woo. There you go, okay. Banded bicycles, band is still around the feet. Bicycling out right to left, right here. Equal side, going right and left. Take it over, hold. Twist through it here. Reach over, kick it out, pause. Take it right back out. Reach, pull. Switch with it here. Good, you guys, drive, 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 drive. Kick it out. Pull it back in, I'm trying to get that flow. I normally set my foam a little bit farther. Hold it to it, take it over, squeeze, squeeze. All right, slow it down, slow it down. Out tight, take it over side to side. We got 18 seconds left right here, go four. Breathe, inhale for three. Exhale, hold it over, twist it out. Switch, switch, so important that you kick that bottom leg, that straight leg goes way out. Take it here, good you guys, so strong. Lock into this here. We hold it over. Left elbow comes to that right knee. Take it over in three. Take your left elbow to your right knee, two. One, pulse it out, go up an inch. Out an 
an inch, up an inch, out an inch. Breathe, take it out. Breathe, take it out. We got just eight. Whoo, check it in. Stay here, good, you guys, so strong. Check it in, breathe it out. We got four. We find that teaser, three. We find it here in two. Sorry, we got that kneeling crunch. In two and one, kneeling crunch. Good, you guys, kneeling crunch before that teaser. So grab those sliders, take it over. Now, I'm gonna show you how to move that left side. Face front, take your hands to your left. Put them down onto those discs. Stack the right knee over left. Kneeling side crunch right here. Take it up, scoop it up. Pull it up and in. We're going teaser after this. I gave it away. There you go, pull it up. But if you did that little demo with me before class, you already know where we're going. Take it out, stop there, pull up on that left oblique. Squeeze into that left side of the body. Slowly take it out, inch by inch. Exhale, pull, pull, drag up and in. There you go, right here. Find that four count right back in. Added challenge, you wanna throw in that wheel row at the bottom, you do so. Kick it out, pull it back in. Squeeze it all the way up. Draw up, 30 seconds right here. Take it out, breathe. Right knee is stacked on top of your left. Pull in, now feel like you're picking up. I want you to find your lowest left rib, got it? Now lift it to the ceiling, through the body, pull it up, squeeze. Squeeze, round through it, push through it here. Good, you guys, 15 seconds, come on. No holds, no pulses. We're just gonna hit that quick transition, turning it around. Left foot is coming in front of right onto those discs. Your hands are gonna replace the knees. We go teaser on the left, in three, two, one, let's go right here, okay? So left foot crosses over right. Hands come down onto that mat. Feet come out, wise and wide. You take it into that teaser here. Pull it up, squeeze up onto that left side. Slowly take it right back out. So very similar to that plank to pike, but your left foot is in front of the right. Pull it up, squeeze it up, hold. Take it right back out. Reach, breathe, take it up, go four. Three, two, hold, take it back for four. Three, two, pause right there, come on. Those you guys, this is it. For that left side, we're gonna repeat everything we just did on the right. Yes, you can. Give it that fight. 15 seconds, let's go. Stay slow, stay true to this right here. Squeeze your inner thighs together, pick it up. I know it's sliding, I know it's tired, but that's how it should be. We're finishing out that left oblique. We don't come back to it. Last six. Woo, here we go for three, two, one, fine, done. That spider lunge, all right. Take that band, place it around the quads. Right foot on the floor, left foot comes onto the disc. Drop it down, now push it back slow. Here you go. You've heard all the cues once before. This is where you get to go into it, fight a little bit stronger, fight a little bit harder. For many of us, that right leg is our dominant leg. That's why we started with the left to get that love. So right leg is down. Push that left foot out and away, hold. Watch that right knee, point it over the second, third toe. Anytime you're in those legs, remember your knees are always in line with those second, third toes. Keeps the joint alignment. Keep the hip square, core in tight, chest tall. Sit a little bit lower, hold. Push it out for four, three, two, hold, slowly draw it right back in. I want you to almost get a sensation like you were falling over into the outside of that right leg. As you push with this right here, stay low. Stay low, hold it back, go four, three, two, hold. All right, here comes back that heart rate, working into those larger muscles right here. Own it. Let's go Monday. You did not get here to give yourself half of your effort. You came here to give yourself 110%. Come on, here we go. It starts with you. Hold it halfway three, hold it halfway two. One, we got those three inches, go down one. Back one, pause. Down two, back two, pause. One more, down three. Push it out for three, here we go. 
Pull my sweat. Okay. Little three inch pushes here. In for one. In for two. Three, hold. Take it out for one. Out for two. Three, hold. Little pushes. Woo. Fight it out, let it work. Set not mind the muscle connection right here. I want you to target it. Tell it, say outer glute, you are working. Outer thigh, you are fighting. Squeeze the core in. Let it lift, you got six. We go back full range, push it back. Three, two, do not come out of this right here. I know you want to, but remember, I got those squats lined up for you there. Those squats are on purpose so that you can come up and rise just a little bit so we aren't into that static hold. But you got this here, here we go. Take it out. Hold in three, two, hold right there. Come on, hold. Hold four, drop down one more. Hold three, find that inner thigh. For two, bring it into that squat in one. Let's go, squat, squat first. Yes. Woo, take it up, let's go, drop it down, go low. Booty back. Take it up. Squeeze. Stop before the top. Take it right back, down low. Here we go, go low. Core tight, chest up. Knees pointed over the second, third toe. Everything you got right here, low. Low, hold. Breathe it up, go slow. Guess what? You got 25 seconds right here. Go low. Breathe it out. Toes light, heels heavy. Stay right here. We got just 10. Holding it all the way down. Next one. In six. Take it down in four, three, two. Hold, reach, hold, reach. Press into it. Core and tight. Yes, you can. We got that elevator lunge. In four, three, two, one. Kick it off. All right. Right foot forward, left foot back. Go down low. Let's go. Slow. Take it down. Reach, hold. Hold there for a second. Set in. Right here, you and me. Check in. Let's go. Up four. Up three. Up two. Stop there. Take it down. Go low. Reach low. There we go. Right here. Squeeze it up. Squeeze it in. So strong. Everything over that right leg right here. Right here. Push down. Down. You're already pushing. You're already squeezing that back right glute. Now if it helps, take your right hand to the back of your right booty. You're just you. No one's watching right here, so as you hold it though, there's something that happens. When I put a touch to the muscle, I'm able to trigger it up just a little sooner, just a little bit more. Holding to it, go low. Low. 20 seconds left with this full range here. Don't block it out, come on. Finish it out right here. We get ready in six. Woo! Take it all the way down. We hit that carriage kick in three, two, one. Let's go. Pull it in for four, three, two. Hold, take it out. Three, two, come on. Hey, here we go. Down an inch. Let's go for four, three, two. Right here, take it in. What was that word? What was that phrase? You need to go back there right now. I know it's burning. I know everything is telling you to come out of this here. But it feels so much better when you give yourself these last six. Go full range, reach it out in three, two, one. You're here. Don't walk it out. Take it down. Come on. 25 seconds. Go. Go. Reach up. Stop before the top. Take it down, go low. One more, all the way up, all the way down. Come on, up and for four. Up for three. Up for two, stop there, take it down. Hold it out. Hold it low in three, two, hold it. Close your eyes, do what you gotta do, but everything squeezes, everything reaches, everything gives it one more. We find that band, we go bungee kicks. In three, two, one, let's go. All right, find that medium resistance band. Quick transitions right here. Don't let that right booty get that chance to turn off. 
breath back to movement. Exhale out for four. Inhale in, hover. It doesn't have to lift high. I'm fighting just to keep my knee up level. Okay, here we go, let it shake. Stay on to it here. It's not called the Legree shake for nothing. Let it burn, let it go, hold it up in four. We hit that hamstring, finish it out in three, two. Kick it out, kick it out. Yes, you can, curl it in for four, three, two, hold. Kick it right back out, neck long. Look three feet in front of you right here. Do not drop that chin to your chest. You are proud posture. That core is in tight. That heel is lifted. Last 10 seconds, come on. Take it out. Hold it straight in six. Hold it straight in three. In two, hold it there. Straight leg, let's go. Up an inch. Down an inch. This is where you finish your legs. This is where you fight a little bit more. This is where you see that finish line. Come on, Monday. Take it up. One more. One more. For four. Three. Bicycle in two. One. Flip it over. Okay. Here we are. Bicycle. Crunching it out. Right to left. Switch. Alternate. Get those shoulder blades up. Twist it out. Right here. Go reach. Breathe. Squeeze. Breathe. There we go. Lock into this right here. 30 seconds, go. Slow. Hold. Take it back. There we go, right here. Come on, Monday. I know you're fighting. Pull those abs in. I want you to think about the low spine, never lifting up. Keep that little gap between the chin and the chest. Look up to the ceiling here. Twist and hold. In three, two, hold right knee, left elbow. Pulse. Out an inch. In an inch. Out an inch. In an inch. Bring right here. You got eight. Get it up a little higher for six. Hold into it. Stay with this. We got kneel and crunch. In three. In two. One. Okay. Big shot, medium resistance band. Disc come over, bring them to your right side. Disc go to the right, hands go down. Knees stay stacked, take it out, hold. Scoop up, pull into that right oblique. Take it out from there, take it out, reach. Reach, hold, squeeze, pull it up and in. 60 seconds right here. There you go, hold it. Pull it back. Hold. Take it out. Woo. Breathe with it. There you go. So strong. Pull. Drag. Squeeze it up. Now that right oblique. Remember. Lift it up. Feel like it is lifting the whole time to that ceiling. Add that wheelbarrow in if you did so on the left. Let's go. Final 30 seconds. Come on. Take it out. Hold. Take it right back. Last eight. One more. All the way up. We're going to flip it to that teaser in four, three, two. Flip it right here. Here we go. Cross your right foot over left onto those. Hands come down. Hold it out. Hold. Pick it up. Squeeze. Hold. Take it out. Breathe. Here we go. Last push. Right foot is in front of the left. Hands are locked down. Take it up. Squeeze, hold. Take it out. Two. Three. Right there. Come on, pull. Pull. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Fight it out. Focus right back in if that mind started to drift. What are you working for? Where is it that the energy that you give into yourself right here shows up when we turn off that phone? When you go and you give it to your job, your family, your loved ones, everybody around you, it matters right here. Let's go, 20 seconds, come on. Take it up, squeeze it up. Bring it with it here, last 10. We got arms to finish, come on. 
Pull up. Reach. Take it out. Good. We're going to use these dips. We're going right into that kneeling push up. Face me in three, in two, one. Okay, guys, here we go. Hands go onto those dips. Take yourself forward. Get in a kneeling position, pusher position. Chest out. Take it down. Hold. Just right here for now. Take it out wide. Hold. Push it up. Take it out. Go wide. We got 25 seconds right here. Your core is a push-up movement. When you're in a push-up, your core is doing just as much as those arms. Pull it up and away from the floor. Hold it down halfway in four. Hold it halfway three. Two, hold it. Hold it there. Shoulders out of the ears. Core in tight. First six. Good, you guys. We get ready. Bring it in. We're going right into those single arm chest pushers in three, two, one. Bring it in. Now, take it out. Okay. Drop it down. Pull it back and in. So the hand turns out. Reach it out. Pull with that chest back in. So it's giving it like a hug a tree. It's like a hug a tree onto the floor. Pull the right one, send your left arm out. Send it out, left arm goes long. Pull, pull it back in four, three, two, pause, right arm out. Push it out, hold, pull it back and in. Feel the chest, feel everything work right here. Level two, go both arms, last 30 seconds, take it out. Hold, pull it in, press. Woo, take it out. You can stay with those single arms. Press, squeeze, squeeze, pull it back together. Let's go, one more. All the way down, all the way down, take it out wide. Pull it back and in slow, slow, slow. Yes, you guys, we get ready in four. Find that medium resistance band, three, two, one. All right, here we go, lift a newspaper. Hands come up, pull it out open. Slowly take those hands right back in. Stop them in front of the elbows over your chest. Pull it right back out. Hold. Let it shake. Stay here. You can easily do this also with those hand weights. I'm going to come a little closer to you. So if you want those hand weights into those hands, you take that modification. Otherwise, it's that. Hold. Breathe it in. Whew. Pull it back through the back of the shoulder. Get the hands over the elbows right here. First 30 seconds. It's like you're trying to snap that band. Pull it out. Out. Dig through the back of the shoulders. Dig through the back of the elbows. You got this here. Open through that chest. Here we go. So as you're working into this here, open, open, squeeze. Hold your core in. Hold your glutes in. Push down. Make a firm foundation beneath you. We got six. We're gonna hold it all the way out. Hold it out in three, two, hold. Hold right there, hang on to it, come on. Hang on to it, breathe it out, stay with it, do not let it go. Yes, you guys, first six. We get ready, take it behind the back. We go lap, pull down, three, two, one. Now we're taking it up overhead, pull it out. Hold, take it up. Reach, pause, take it out. Hold, reach. Take it up, Ooh, let it shake. Hang on to it, good, you guys, so sharp. Pull, now you can always sit back up to those heels for that modification, but to keep that heart rate up a little higher, take it up, squeeze. Pull it out, take it out. So again, you're reaching those hands, opening through those shoulders. Pull down through that back right here. Hang on to it, keep it strong. Woo. Push into this here, guys, you guys. It's kind of like that big butterfly muscle. So if you were ever a swimmer, that's where you're kind of working into right here. As you reach, hold that resistance. Push it out. Stop the hands in front of the shoulders. Pull it back. Drop it down. Keep the chest up. Chin up. Breathe. You guys are here. Last five minutes of class. Come on. Fight it out. Work for it. So strong. Hold it back. Hold it out in three. Hold it out in two, one, hold it, let it shake, little hinges, out an inch, in an inch, just push, out one, 
in one. Holy moly. Take it here. Good, you guys. We take it back behind us. Four. Chest opener. In three, two. So unhook one hand. Lock the other one behind it. Kick it back. Slowly take it back. Stay on by the sides of the body. Press it back. Open with that chest. Slowly take it in. That time is on. Let's go. Push. Open. Woo. Check it in. Okay. Now I always say with chest opener, this is your correcting that hunchback posture that we're so accustomed to by driving, by being on those phones, by hunching over. This is where you're gonna combat that. Pull back, squeeze. Think about getting your shoulders farther away from each other. So you're not just pushing the arms back. You're actually opening with that chest. Give me that superwoman chest right here. Push it out. Whew. Some Gal Gadot happening. Let's go. Push it out. Go four, three, two. Hold, take it right back out. Yes, you guys, to boss. Check it in. So good. We're gonna kick it into those triceps. Drop the chest, pick up the elbows, kick it back in four, three, two, hold it down, kick it back, kick it back. Hold, slowly take it right back in. Do not let that band pull those hands within your elbows. I want your hands directly underneath those elbows. Kick it back, squeeze, slowly take it right back down. Little breath, little breath right there. Keeping us on 10, here we go. Push it out, hold. Take it back slow. Now that core is not just dropped over. That core, that belly button is still pulled back to spine. I meant it when I said it in the beginning of class, that the second you staple that belly button back to spine, it does not move. It holds there. Get the neck long. Look three to four feet in front of you. Pull the elbows up. Squeeze it in. Push it back. Last 10. For eight. Come on, we push it back. We're gonna pulse it out in four. Take it back. In three, two, pull, pulse it out. Out. Let go. Reach. Reach. Come on. Take it here. Pulse it out. We're finishing class. We're going into those plank holds right here. Meet me in the center in four. Meet me in the center in three, two, one. Check it out really quick. Here we go, last little push. Take it center, plank it out, hold. Modification is on those knees, you do you. But this is where I want you to fight strong. Take it out. 30 seconds right here, hold. How do you feel? How do you feel giving yourself everything you've already given yourself to this point? Okay, now let's give it three minutes. Three minutes, it's short, it's sweet. No matter how you feel about the work you've given into this year, know that you are perfect, you are exactly where you should be. This is your chance right here to finish out, to put that explanation point onto that workout. Stay with it. Take it up, pull it up, breathe it in. We're gonna open it up. This is my left hand, my left hand's gonna stay down. We're going side plank, open it up. Option to drop that knee in three, two, one. Take it open. You can drop down to that left knee. Hold into it, stay wherever you are. But we breathe right here. 30 seconds, let's go. Take it up, breathe it out. When we're in a class, sometimes stillness is the absolute hardest thing you can do. But remember right here, you are pulling up through that left oblique. Don't just hang, pull up, scoop up. Push away from that left hand. Reach it up. Hold still. Move with your breath. Inhale, get longer. Exhale, pull a little tighter. Last eight. You're coming back to that center, to that plank. <laughs> Take it over in three, in two, and one. Plank it out, plank it out right here. Close your eyes, all right. Now this is that point that if you need to take that little rest and give me a plank from your knees, I want you to do so because you got just another 10 seconds before we're gonna open it up, stacking ourselves on top of the right in three, two, one. Pick it up, hold with it here. There we go. Last 60 seconds of class is on. Reach up, act 
activate those fingertips. Activate the crown of the head. Push the heels away from you. Scoop that right up. What do you got? Come on. Last 10. Do not back out on this right here. I know I can't see you, but come on. Let's go. Plank it out in three, two, one. Plank it. Plank it. Hold. Don't question it. If you're on those knees, can you give yourself that challenge? That hold. Take it up. Pull it up. Breathe. Hold it here. Scoop those abs in. Roll the shoulders out of the ears. Hold that core tight. You have 15 seconds. Let it shake. Pull those abs in. Breathe. You're here. Last eight. That child's pose is coming up, but you gotta work for it. It feels better when you wait till one. It feels better when you wait till one. We got five. We got four. Three, two, one. Sink it down. Breathe. Oh. Oh. Monday. How do you feel? That breath, that heartbeat, that heart rate, that's yours. You worked for it. You overcame all the obstacles. You overcame all the excuses, all the reasons of why it would have been easier to not just give yourself those 45 minutes. But I'm so grateful that you guys chose to be with me on your Monday evening. You guys are fantastic. I love getting to spend some time with you. Stretch it out really quick. If you have to go, drink lots of water. Stretch, please. It's so good for that body. Um, little Q&A time. So if you guys have any questions whatsoever, right now I can um, really kind of pull this close. Oh, yay. Yes, I love the mother-daughter teams. Thank you, guys. Um, and then the one thing I'll address is just as you guys will be seeing it is I am going to start now that we announced that this whole quarantine thing's going through the end of April. Um, I did pin my Venmo's just on there. Um, remember I'm, this is a donation based thing completely. Like I never ever want there to be a point where you have to feel like you have to choose between like a financial decision and like working out and taking care of your body. I think it's so important to take care of our bodies right now. So um, just know that like it's not an expectation. Um, it's just an opening because um, a lot of people have asked and just uh, to, to allow me to like, keep doing what I love doing and you guys allow me to do that. So I appreciate you a lot, a lot, like a lot. <laughs> All right, cross, reach out front, like forward. Uh, but yeah, as always, you guys, my name is Zing, and if you have questions, need a modification, anything, please reach out, have questions on equipment. Those highlight videos are up, so if you guys can check out on those, those, I will get the obliques and the arm ones up by Wednesday as well. Um, and then I've been uploading, I think there's about eight uh, YouTubes that are up of the workouts that we've done. Um, I'm planning on getting up another two tonight. So this is like a thing, guys. You, you guys are my, my job. <laughs> you kept me busy reaching back into that stretch. Oh, you guys are awesome. Thank y'all. Take that stretch right here. Do we have anyone out of state? Anyone out of California joining in, popping in? Take it into that stretch, hold it out. Out of country? <laughs> there we go. Oh. Okay, take that final seat. Take it all the way down. Both feet come in front of you. Take that stretch. Roll it up. Reach it all the way to the ceiling. Oh, open it up. Open it up. Monday. You guys are awesome. Take it all the way forward. Fold it down. Take a huge breath in. Feel that love. Feel that joy. Oh, embrace it. Give it a name. Give it a feeling and carry it through the rest of your day, through the rest of your week. I hope to hang out with you guys a little bit more this week. Take it out, and you guys have a fantastic rest of your guys' evening. Bye.